All right, guys, how are we doing? Welcome, Christina with Lift It Yoga. Thank you for being here. I'm not sure what we're going to do today. It's going to be a surprise. I'm going to improv today. We'll see how we feel, and then I'll be sure to title this video accordingly. All right, let's get started. Today we're going to get started in child's pose. Come to the back of your mat. Open your knees out nice and wide. Reach your arms forward as you sit your hips back towards your heels. Release your forehead to your mat. Gently rest your elbows down. Lengthen through your fingertips as you expand through your inner thighs. Feel your hips start to open. Take a full breath in. And an open mouth exhale. Good. Breathe just like that on your own. Taking full, rich inhales and full open mouth exhales, emptying all the way out. As you elongate your breath, begin to build a sense of presence in your practice. Focus on the here and now, pushing out all thoughts that don't serve you, letting go of your morning, tuning in to exactly where you're at right here, tuning into your body, what is calling to you? What does your physical body say? What do you need? On your next breath cycle, seal your lips. Breathe in through your nose. Ujjayi, inhale. Ujjayi, exhale through the nose. Create a constriction at the back of your throat. Using your throat muscles, drag the breath across, creating an oceanic sound. Again, Ujjayi, inhale as you breathe in through your nose. Ujjayi, exhale, breathing out of your nose. Constrict the back of your throat. Build heat in your body. But inhale, tabletop, push up to your hands and breathe as you walk your legs in hip width distance. Squeeze your belly as tight as can be. Make your spine flat and long. Inhale, cow pose, press your belly down towards your mat. Soft bend to the elbows. Push your heart forward. Sorry, I think our pool guy's here. Exhale, cat pose. Squeeze your belly in tight as can be. Chin to throat. Good. Inhale, cow pose. And exhale, cat pose. Inhale, cow pose. Exhale, cat pose. Good. Inhale, tabletop. Hold here. And breathe out. And inhale, lengthen your right arm nice and long. Tuck your right toes under. Exhale, lift your left leg. Take a full breath in. Exhale, bird dog crunch, elbow to knee. Connect your elbow and knee directly underneath your belly button. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. And inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. Let's take two more. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. One more. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. Good. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, tabletop. And inhale, lengthen your left arm long with your thumb facing up. Tuck your left toes under. Exhale, lift your right leg. Flex your foot. Drive through the fingertips and heel. Breathe in. Exhale, bird dog crunch. Elbow to knee. Squeeze your belly. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. Hug your belly in tight. We'll take two more. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. One more time. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, tabletop. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, down dog. Send your hips to the sky. Press into the balls of your feet. Keep your legs hip width distance. Soft bend to the knees. Melt your heart towards your thighs. Push the mat away with your hands. Feel your tailbone lift and sharpen. And then pedal it out. Bend into your knees. Wake up your hamstrings. Find stillness in your down dog. Inhale, gaze between your hands. Exhale, ragdoll with an asana. Walk to the top of your mat. Take a nice wide stance here. Bend generously into both knees. Grab opposite elbows, sway side to side. Take any movements that serve you here. You can stay still or create movements.
shift weight into the balls of your feet. And find stillness in your rag doll. Take your left hand to your right ankle. Let's take a simple twist here. Walk your fingertips to the outside of the right ankle. Gently use the strength of your left arm to pull your chest towards your right thigh. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. I'm gonna release your left hand down to your mat. Gently walk your right hand over to the left. Just a simple little twist over to the left. Use the strength of your right arm to pull your chest towards your thigh. Be sure your knees are micro bent, at least relieving tension in the hamstrings. Breathe in and breathe out. And release your right hand down. Walk your feet into a comfortable distance. Dome your shoulder blades, chin to throat. Inhale, slowly rise on up. Exhale, equal standing pose, Samastitihi. Roll your shoulders up and down your spine. Connect your hands at heart center. Extend through your elbows. Close your eyes or tuck your chin down towards your chest. Take a full breath in. And a full breath out. Good, again, deep breath in. And a deep breath out and then come back to your Ujjayi inhale. Good, inhale, mountain pose, Tadasana. Reach your arms overhead. As you breathe, firm your feet into your mat, fan out your toes, squeeze your belly as tight as can be. Take steeple grip with your hands, releasing your index finger. Push your palms together. Inhale, lengthen through your fingertips. Exhale, steeple grip back bend. Push your hip points forward. Keep your elbows micro bent. And take your gaze up as you push firmly into your hands. Good, inhale, mountain pose with steeple grip. And then exhale, steeple grip, forward fold. And keep your hands connected. Good work. Inhale, halfway lift. Bring your hands to the front of your legs. Shift weight into the balls of your feet to fire up your hamstrings. Squeeze your belly as tight as can be. Breathe in. And breathe out. One more breath in. Exhale, fold. Good job. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. But inhale, mountain pose, Tadasana, steeple grip, release your index finger. Exhale, steeple grip, back bend, soft bend to the elbows, push your hips forward, squeeze your glutes. Good, inhale, mountain pose, keep the steeple grip. Exhale, forward fold, lead with your heart. Bend your elbows, soft bend to the knees. And inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. And we'll take that again. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Okay, one more time. Inhale, mountain pose. Steeple grip. Exhale, back bend. Good, inhale, mountain. Exhale, standing forward fold. Good, inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, squat and curl. Lift your heels, bend your knees. Bring your fingertips to your mat. Dome your shoulder blades. Feel that spread across the shoulders and upper back as you hug your belly in as tight as can be. Feel the stretching sensation at the soles of your feet. Good. Ground your heels down to your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high plank, hands to your mat. Step your feet back, hip width distance. Align your shoulders over wrists. Hug your belly in as tight as can be. Breathe in. Exhale, lower down to your belly. Walk your hands back several inches. Hug your inner arms into your rib cage. Inhale, full cobra. Press up to your hands. Lift your hip flexors off of the mat and breathe. Then adjust your hands accordingly. I'm gonna walk the hands back just a little bit. Gaze forward on your inhale. Exhale, turn your chin to the right. Stretch out the neck muscles and the shoulder collar blade. <laughs> Inhale, center, then exhale to the left. Good, inhale, center, and exhale slowly, lower down to your belly. Good work. Walk your hands forward, inhale, high plank, push up. Exhale, down dog. Take a full breath in, and a full breath out. Good, inhale, shift forward. 
Exhale, lower down to your belly. Good job. Inhale, baby cobra. This time, keep your hands as they are. Lift your hands and your kneecaps off the mat. Press the top of your feet firmly down to your space. Breathe in. Exhale, release your hands down to your mat. Inhale, high plank, tuck your toes. Exhale, down dog, nice work. Take a full breath in and a full breath out. Good, inhale, gaze forward, shift to high plank. Exhale, lower down to your belly. Interlace all 10 fingers at your lower back. Take a bind. Inhale, bound locust pose. Lift your legs, lift your arms, and breathe as you use your back muscles to lift. Take a full breath in. And exhale, lower down. Good work. Bend your elbows, tuck your toes. Inhale, high plank. Exhale, downward facing dog. Breathe in. And breathe out. And inhale, three legged down dog. Lift your right leg high to the sky. Exhale, runner's lunge. Step your right foot to the outside of your right pinky. Push your hands firmly into your mat. Shift your weight forward and back. Good. Really good. And then walk your left hand out just a little bit, several inches to the left. Lift your right hand off the mat and then push your inner thigh away from you, rolling onto the knife edge of the right foot. Release your right hand down to your mat. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Lift your right leg up. Exhale, scorpion, bend your knee. Keep your shoulder blades square to your mat. Drive through the heel, lift your knee higher, stretching out the inner thighs and groin. Good, inhale, three-legged down dog. Exhale, down dog, good work. Inhale, three-legged down dog, lift your left leg to the sky, drive through your heel. Exhale, runner's lunge, step your left foot to the outside of the left pinky. Press into your hand, shift your weight forward and back. Creating movement here in our runner's lunge. And find stillness in your runner's lunge. Walk your right hand out just a few inches. Lift your left hand up on the inhale. And exhale, push your inner thigh away from you, rolling onto the knife edge of the left foot. Release your left hand down to your mat. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Kick your left leg up. Exhale, scorpion. Bend your knee. Drive through the heel, bringing your heel as close to your booty as you can. Lift your knee higher. Press your left shoulder down. Wear off the shoulder blades and chest muscles to your mat. Good. Breathe in. And breathe out. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Exhale, down dog. Nice job. We'll take that through again, adding on. Inhale, three-legged down dog, lift your right leg. Exhale, runner's lunge. Good, shift your weight forward and back. Breathe in. And breathe out, and then we'll ground the left knee down for passive runner's lunge, stretching out some more. Release your forearms down to your mat. Breathe into it. And push up to your hands. Tuck your left toes under. Lift your knee. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Kick up. Exhale, scorpion. And then let's take circles with the knee here. Nice big circles. And then change the direction of the circles. And inhale, three-legged down dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Lift your left leg. Exhale, runner's lunge, step your left foot forward, shift forward and back. Drop your right knee down, passive runner's lunge here, drop down to your forearms. 
Good. Inhale, push up to your hands. Exhale, tuck your right toes under. Lift your knee. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Exhale, scorpion. Let's create circles with the knee here. And then switch out the direction of the circles. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, frog pose. Step or hop forward. Line up the inner arches of your feet to the long edges of your mat. Sink your hips down to your mat. Open up through the inner thighs. Connect your hands at heart center. Nice job. Set up as tall as you can here. Just balancing on the feet. Good. Elevate your heart. Broaden through the chest and shoulders. Release your hands down to your mat, and inhale, lift your booty. Exhale, walk your feet in, hip width distance, gorilla pose, slide your hands underneath your feet. Connect your toes to your wrists, shift into the balls of your feet, bend your elbows, and surrender. Good work. Release your hands from underneath your feet. Toe heel your feet together. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Good. Inhale, chair pose, Utkatasana. Bend your knees. Frame your biceps to your ears as you sit your hips back to your heels. Squeeze your belly tight. Full breath in. Exhale, prayer twist. Connect your hands at heart center. Push your heart forward. Twist to the right. Elbow to the outside of the right thigh. Dry your knees in one line. Lift through the top shoulder. Breathe in. Exhale, twist deeper. Sit deeper. Good. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, prayer twist to the left. Connect your hands. Right elbow to the outside of the left knee. Good. Lift through the top shoulder. Dry your knees in one straight line. Keeping those knees and hips square. Breathe in. And exhale, twist deeper, lift through the top and left shoulder. Get another breath in. Exhale, forward fold. Good job. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Good work. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, eagle on the right. Swing the right arm underneath your left. Connect your hands. Ground down through the left leg. Find that stability. Lift your right leg up and over. Single wrap, double wrap, or kickstand your toe. Draw your knees and elbows in one line, then elevate your elbows in line with your shoulders. Work your forearms forward and compress at the inner thighs. Deep breath in and deep breath out. Good, another breath in and out. Fabulous job, inhale, chair pose. Exhale, eagle on the left, swing the left arm underneath the right, connect your hands. Ground down through the right leg, firm it down. In fact, bend out all 10 toes to support that right foot. Lift your left leg up and over. Kickstand, single wrap or double wrap. Draw your elbows and knees in one line. Elevate your elbows in line with your shoulders. Squeeze and compress, squeezing at the inner thighs. Deep breath in. And a deep breath out. So good. Stay with this breath. Full breath in. And full breath out, my friends. Good, inhale, chair pose. Exhale, standing forward, fold, fabulous job. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high plank, take your hands to your mat, hold high plank here, some belly strengthening. Align shoulders over wrists, squeeze your belly tight, pull it up and in. You'll feel that stretch across the shoulder blades and a broadening across the upper back muscles. Press your heels to the back of the room to elongate the back sides of your legs. Breathe in and stay for the exhale. Get another breath in. Exhale, downward facing dog, fabulous job. 
Inhale, three-legged down dog, lift your right leg. Exhale, half pigeon, right knee to the right wrist. Walk your shin forward, as forward as you can. For some of us, you'll create an L shape depending on the depth of the hip joint. Sit up as tall as you can. You can stay here, avoid dumping into either hip, square off the hips. And then you can hinge forward for sleeping pigeon. If you have a lot of pain in this asana, then please come down to your back for supine figure four. On your back, getting a hip stretch through supine figure four rather than half pigeon. Inhale, push up to your hands. <clears throat> Exhale, tuck your left knee. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Exhale, down dog. At inhale, three-legged down dog, lift your left leg. Exhale, half pigeon on the left knee to left wrist. Walk your shin as forward as you can. Walk your hands back, sit up tall and proud. Stay here, avoid dumping into either hip. You can stay or sleep your pigeon. Surrender down or take supine figure four on this side. Inhale, push up to your hands. Exhale, tuck your right toes under, lift your knee. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Exhale, down dog. Good, inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, high plank. Shift your left hand directly underneath your chin. Inhale, side plank to the right. Roll onto the knife edge of the left foot. Reach your arm up to the sky and breathe. You may stack the feet, stagger them, or lift the top leg. Take tree variation. You choose or drop the bottom knee. Lift through the top hip and squeeze your glutes to stabilize your pelvic floor. Breathe in. Stay for the exhale. Good, another breath in. Exhale, high plank. Gracefully walk your right hand directly underneath your chin. Inhale, side plank to the left. Roll onto the knife edge of the left foot. Reach your left arm up, stack the shoulders. Again, any variation with the top leg that you desire. Tree variation lift stay as you are stack or stagger the feet or drop and ground the bottom knee that works beautiful or you can extend through the top hand reaching forward breathe in breathe out good one more breath in exhale high plank hold here take a full breath in exhale downward facing dog fabulous drop then drop down to your knees for hero's pose variation Feel free to separate your feet out and have a seat on your booty, or you can have a seat on your heels. Roll your shoulders up and down your spine. Nice work today. <clears throat> we'll take eagle variation with the arms. Inhale, reach your arms up to the sky. Exhale, eagle on the right. Familiar? Swing the right arm underneath the left. Touch your palms. Take a full breath in. And then exhale, dome the shoulder blades. Fold forward here, surrender down and relax. Nice stretch through the upper back and shoulder muscles. That's all we're doing here. Good work. Good inhale, reach up, unwind the arms. Exhale, eagle arms on the left. Swing the left arm underneath the right. Touch your palms. Breathe in. And then squeeze, dome the shoulders. Fold forward, surrender.
Good, inhale, unwind, reach up. Exhale, come to standing on your knees. Take your hands at your lower back. Align shoulders over hips. <sighs> camel poses next, inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, camel pose with your hands to your lower back. Lift your chin away from your throat. Push your hip points forward. Good, arch your back. Squeeze your booty muscles. And then take your gaze forward. Align shoulders over hips. Kick your legs off to either side. Extend your legs out nice and long. Remove the goodness from underneath you. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, seated forward fold. Paschimottanasana, reach towards your feet, leading with your heart. Soft bend to the knees if you prefer. Dome the shoulder blades and surrender down. Stretch out the glutes and hamstrings. Good, inhale, slowly rise on up, roll your shoulders up and down your spine, and then bend your right knee here. Have the sole of your foot come to your inner thigh, inhale, reach your arms up, and then exhale, twist over to the right just a little bit, leaning into that right knee, flex your left foot. Root down through both sits bones. light on the fingertips here inhale reach your arms up exhale lengthen your right leg in front of you and just go ahead and bend that left knee as you lengthen inhale and then exhale twist towards the left knee walk your hands forward flex your right foot notice the right hip or glute it just lifted so press it down get deep into the stretch so sometimes we do this in wide-legged forward I should say seated wide-legged separate leg stretch However, today we're just keeping that extended leg straight in front of us, nice and long, getting more of a stretch through the side body and really getting deep into, deeper into this pose, into the stretch, allowing our chest to come towards the knee or the shin. Good, inhale, slowly rise on up and exhale, butterfly your knees out. Press the soles of your feet together. So upright Supta Baddha Konasana or butterfly pose. Press your heart forward. Use energy to really push the knees out to the long edges of your mat. Stretching out the groin. If you'd like to dome the shoulder blades and surrender, please do so. And on your next inhale, slowly rise on up. And then just wiggle your feet forward. Now I'd like you to bend the bottom knee, so right knee, and then point it forward here. So you're placing pressure on the right outer ankle. And then lift the left leg over, press into the sole of your foot, align the knee joints here. Now the left glute is lifted just a little. So you're shifting weight into the right glute. No worries. Then walk your left hand behind you. Inhale, reach your arm overhead, right arm overhead. Exhale, half Lord of the Fishes variation. Use your elbow to really twist at the thoracic spine, or you can use your hand. Then inhale, reach your right arm up. Exhale, release it down. And then release your legs long in front of you. Chach out your knees. Good, bend your right knee. Then bend your left knee, that's the bottom knee. And draw your knee in line with your belly button. Lift your right foot up and over. 
pressing the sole of your foot down. Align the knee joints as much as you can. Walk your right hand behind you, staying light on the fingertips. Inhale, lengthen and reach the left arm up. Exhale, half Lord of the Fishes variation. Use your elbow to twist at the thoracic spine or use your hand to twist. Inhale, lift your left arm up. Exhale, release your hand down. Cha-cha out your legs. Extend through both legs. One knee at a time. Really nice work. And then shift your booty forward. Be sure your glutes are lined up at the middle of your mat. Slowly lower down with strength and control of your core. Nice and controlled. Inhale, hug your knees into the outside of your rib cage. Exhale, happy baby. Flex your feet. Take your hands to the insides or outsides of your feet. Be sure your tailbone is rooted to your to the earth, to your mat. Take any variation of happy baby, rocking it side to side, staying still, or ninja kick your baby. Straightening out your knees and legs. Melt your shoulders firmly down. Get that stress, stretching sensation through the hamstrings and inner thighs. And relax. Good, inhale, hug your knees into center. Exhale, legs up the wall. Lift your legs directly above you. Go ahead and roll out the ankles as you align your joints. Feel free to extend your hands down to your mat or reach your arms overhead. And then go ahead and switch out the direction of those circles if you'd like. Good. Inhale, hug your knees into your rib cage. Exhale, place both feet on the mat, hip width distance, lengthen through your hands, push and shimmy your shoulders close together. Inhale, lift your hips. Exhale, bind at your lower back. Gently release your hands and arms to your mat as you lift through the hips. Energetically drag your heels towards your glutes. Feel your hamstrings fire up. Feel your lower belly warm and work. Breathe in and breathe out. Good, one more breath in. Exhale, Supta Baddha Konasana, release the bind. Butterfly out your knees, press the soles of your feet together. Close your eyes. Round down, my friends. All right. Open up your eyes, inhale, hug your knees into your chest. Exhale, give yourself a nice squeeze, a hug. Breathe in. And exhale, Shavasana, release and relax. Extend your arms and your legs. Close your eyes. And welcome to your final resting pose. not a good Shavasana song. I'm so sorry. I apologize. I'm going to switch out that song.
Yogis, if you'd like more time in Shavasana, please stay as you are. If you are ready to move on, and begin to awaken your body, inviting movements slowly. Wiggling out your joints, your fingers and wrists, toes, and your ankles. Working up to your major joints, your elbows, and your neck. And reach your arms overhead. Inhale, wall to wall stretch. Take a full breath in. And exhale, fetal pose. Bend your knees. Use your bottom arm as a pillow for your knee. And when you're ready, press yourself up to a comfortable seated position. Sitting up as tall as you possibly can. With your eyes closed, connect your hands at heart center, extend through the elbows, elevate your thumbs to your forehead. Thank you so much for being here. Such a pleasure to guide you through your practice. And I humbly bow to you from my heart to yours. Namaste.